Martin head coach Bob Weger would pull out all the stops in this game, which turned out to be an instant classic. Down 6 0 and setting up for a field goal. Weger calls for the fake. Holder Josh Watson picks it up from the eight, and he's in for the touchdown. Martin up 7 6. Want more special teams? Allen Punter, Caleb Hurrah can't handle the low snap, and then it's kicked around before Martin's Demarcus Bowers falls on it in the end zone. Martin up 21 12 with just under a minute to play in the second quarter, but with 20 seconds to glow. Huge turning point as the band is getting ready to go in the, on the field in the background. Kyler Murray takes off for a 75 yard touchdown run. Murray struggled the whole first half, but with that run, he made it 21 19 at the break. They would trade blows in the second half. Nick Smith goes in from the six as he ran for 266 yards. Martin up 35 26. Then Murray hits Cody Butler with a three yard TD pass to make it 35 33. Allen's defense holds finally, and when Murray gets the ball back, he takes off again. Look at that speed. That's a 49-yard touchdown run. He rushed for 197 yards, and Allen led 41-35 going into the fourth. But hold on. Here comes the Warriors. Trey Brown takes off on the quarterback keeper, and it's a 22-yard touchdown run. Extra point, no good. 41-41. Then on the ensuing kickoff, watch Jalen Jones snip out the sideline. And he's gone. 81 yards on the kickoff return for six, putting the Eagles up 48-41. Talk about back and forth. This game was just incredible. Then the backbreaker. Martin's Eric Walker throws to Christian Levy. The ball goes right through his hands and into the midst of Anthony Taylor. He's got nothing but daylight in front of him. That's a pick six. Allen up two scores, and Martin would never erase that deficit. Allen advances by scoring 28 points in the fourth quarter to win it 69-54. The three-peat dream is still alive, and they will play the winner of our next game.